This is Twit. It's been a while, as ever, as longtime viewers or listeners of the show know that I'm, I'm very much into productivity apps and to-do apps and things like that. But I haven't visited, revisited the the uh, topic in a while because I feel like it's kind of been done. You know, Todoist is out there. Wonderlist was there, then went away. There's some great apps. Uh, but then I came across this app called Nirvana. Uh, it's called Nirvana, and it is a to-do productivity app that is specifically built around the productivity uh, school of thought called GTD or getting things done. Mm-hmm. And and why I thought this was interesting is because if you if you're aware of getting things done, and I highly recommend if you're into productivity or if you're into ways to work better to get the book Getting Things Done by David Allen and read it, it is quite literally a a life changer. Um, but if you read that book and you subscribe to the GTD, GTD method, um, you'll find that other to-do apps have been fine because they help you keep track of things and do stuff like that. But you always have to factor in GTD into the to-do apps. This is finally a to-do app that factors GTD into the – in just to the general – the way it all works. Um, so it's a really nice app. Uh, of course, as you can see here in Jason demo it, it's, uh, you know, it's got the lovely material design as well as the, uh, well, as little kind of soft touches here and there. Um, you can set up tasks. You can, you know, you can, you can give it a title, you can give it a tag, you can give it a little, just, uh, uh, a little, uh, description. Uh, you can give it, give it a reminder, set a due date. What I also like about Nirvana is it allows you to assign an energy level. Um, to it because that's a that's a hmm. big thing as well. How much energy you're going to need to do it? Um, you know that's that's a kind of somewhat new factor within uh, you know productivity mm-hmm. and getting things done. If I can hammer through ten low energy things as opposed to one high energy thing, mm-hmm. that you know like it's yeah. making those decisions and balancing it. Um, so it's really really cool. If you hit a, if you go back to the to the main view away from the details of an in, individual task and you tap the hamburger menu in the up, upper left hand corner, you can see that much like the GTD method, you have at the very top capture and your inbox, and this is where you capture the things you need to do. You're going to say, okay, you know, so right now it's empty. I need to read that book, right? I need to, um, I need to fix the whatever. I need to recode the, that process. I need, you know, you can do a whole bunch of things. You dump them all into your um, into your inbox, and then what you can th- then do is you can. Uh, I like you keep it up with all my tasks, right? Um, you can then, if you go back to the, if you go to the menu, um, to the hamburger menu, you can see then you can categorize things as what I'm going to do absolutely next, what I'm waiting to do, what's scheduled to do. That's in terms of the scheduling aspect of the tasks. But then if you go back to the, um, if you go back to the menu, there's an area called prior called prioritize, and there you can see focus. And focus allows you to say, if you tap right there in the middle, focus. So anything that was starred in the app is, is the things that you're focusing on. So for example, in my day-to-day at work, I've got a task list that's about 30 tasks long, but today I'm only going to focus on these three things, and these are the things I'm going to stay focused on, um, and I'm going to delay the, you know, the other ones as needed through the scheduling or whatnot. And then finally on the menu, um, you can organize uh, you can organize your projects uh, by hitting the little projects folder. And you can start, you know, they when you get the app, they start uh, start you with a project called Brush Up on GTD, right? But you can start a new project. We can say, you know, you know, Android Dev or whatever you want to call it, um, things to do, right? And so, um, as you create tasks in your inbox, you can you can drop them into projects. It really works great. It's fantastic. Um, Nirvana also has a web version that you can log in and it syncs to everything. So anything you do in the app syncs to the web version. So if you're at work and you don't want to be on your phone, you can pop over to a web browser and see it there. Um, So yeah, so Nirvana for GTD, this is a great productivity to do app. Uh, If you subscribe to getting things done, this is like your dream app. So there you go. Sorry, I'm, I'm, I have to move these into the things. That's fair. Yeah, no, I said. I get it. Where did I get that to that? Yeah, there it is. Down the bottom. Projects. Things Ron yeah, said is. now has two tasks in it. Read yep. that book and code that thing. And I'm going to focus on reading that book today. So, yeah, there it is. All right. Then when you're done, um, you just go, you yep, read that book. It, reading that book was as easy as reading And what's book. cool now is if you if you pop over, back, go back one more and go to the menu and then um, scroll down to the very bottom, clean up. This is the best thing ever. You just say clean up logbook. And it will take the completed task and Oops. just kind of Sorry, that was wipe trash. it away, right? So if you go back to the things Ron said, right? Com- collect completed a- items. Collect it. Yep. Collect it. Collect. 
and, and move through book. that book into your logbook. So you can say you can keep track of what I did, but it'll take it out of the project and put it into your logbook so you can go back and revisit it. So Completed today, yeah. March 13th. Yeah. Awesome. Cool. Love it. Nirvana for GTD. And it's free. Registered so. trademark. <laughs> but yeah. GTD is a registered, is copyrighted. So yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mr. David Allen, I had the pleasure of interviewing him once a few years ago, and he was delightful. So, yeah. Oh, nice. Oh, Good stuff. 